The closed signs are on the door behind me. A lot of unhappy customers this morning after deputies raided and shut down this illegal internet cafe. This place walks like a duck, it quacks like a duck, it swims like a duck, it's a duck, it's gambling. Deputies confiscating dozens of games and cold hard cash from the Hotspot Internet Cafe Tuesday morning. They're parasites, because if you look at who the customers are, the customers are elderly folks on a fixed income. Customers like Stephen Hodge leaving the cafe say they're disappointed. I'm disabled, I got hot, hot problems, medical problems, and I can't work, so this gives me something to do instead of sitting at the house all day. Sheriff Chitwood says during their two-month long undercover investigation. They tracked $600,000 in just two months, believing the money is being funneled to North Carolina. This is a business that's not regulated. They're not paying business tax. There's no inspection. There's no fire marshal. There's no building. There's no nothing. We try talking to the owner's son, who the sheriff says manages the facility, but he declined to comment. The sheriff says he's not facing any charges at this time. The law enforcement stuck between a rock and a hard place. You have a law in the books that's basically unenforceable. We can go out and make an arrest. I could pour hundreds of man hours into this to get what in return. And Sheriff Chitwood says his deputies will be serving a cease and desist letter today to the other internet cafe operators in Volusia County. We're coming for you, okay? The ball has already started. So if you were smart, you'd pull out of business tonight. In Ormond Beach, Lauren Korn, News 6.